but ultimately I prefer don't even say a word because what I'm pointing at is go towards silence. Of course, your mind needs some sort of direction because you're confused because you've been brainwashed and you've been conditioned to believe that you are someone doing something. And as a result of that, you keep suffering because you keep failing and you don't get what you want. And when you get it, you lose it. Finally, when you got everything, you have it for a period of time that everything is great and then it falls apart and then you suffer again. So I'm sharing these things with you. But ultimately, I would prefer to just be silent because everything is directing you to silence. This teaching that I share with you is to help you answer some of your questions that the mind has. But the actual teaching is a transmission that happens through silence. The transmission that happens in being quiet. Because only when you're quiet and you're silent means the mind slows down the heart opens and the true wisdom comes from the heart. The love. When the mind has no questions, the mind is silence. There's no question of God. There's no question of oneness. There's no question of ascending to fifth dimension. None of these things exist anymore because there is no thoughts. You're silent, you're here. And you know. Because you recognize the love. Anybody has any questions? Can they write on the chat box? Okay, we're going to open the chat box. Sorry, we had it shut down. Either, yeah. We had to take the option of unmuting yourself because of this. It's open. They can unmute themselves or the chat box. Yeah, you can write a message or those of you who I can see you, you can wave at me and I'll unmute you and we can talk. And I can't answer on Facebook and on Instagram. I appreciate you write to me, but I can't answer you. If you want to communicate with me, come on our website, zaratustra.tv. Go to the calendar, free online global self-awakening workshop. Click on that. Scroll down and register there and come on Zoom so I can communicate with you. Okay. Susanna. Okay. Hi, Hi Susanna. Hello, Zara. Hi. 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 First of all, <laughs> I, I, it took me a while to recognize, to remember, but... 
<laughs> not, Love it, not remember who you are. It's so nice to connect with you. Likewise. Forever. I think the last time was like four years ago or something. Yeah. I, yeah. 2016, I believe it was. Wow. That was the last time I was okay. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, we met right. many times here in Denmark. It was so good. Um, I would like to say thank you for today. It resonates with me so much. It's so amazing. Everything makes sense, what you say to me. And then I realized uh, the past, everything was navigating me to this point. Mm -hmm. right. So for me, really makes sense. And it's big relieving with, uh, with the responsibility thing. Okay. That you can just give it away. And for right. me, it's just like, thanks God. For me, it's really like, finally. <laughs> so I really want to say thank you because it's really going like a puzzle uh, game together for me. For me. Right. I get it. Uh, so thank you. Big thank uh, But I want I have a question. We have the responsibility to take, to take care about the body, right? About the avatar we're using. So what we're gonna do when it's coming in place, the new technology, uh -huh. and it's gonna change actually the nature for us as our avatar operates. The body is just like resonating on some vibrations. But with the new global technology, the vibration will be different. Right. So what we can do okay. or what is it like there? Yeah, you do the next thing, whatever the next thing is. When the time comes, that which is running the show, yeah. Her Majesty the Supreme, will present you with the next step. So we don't need to worry about it. Cool. That same force that has brought you all the way to this point is responsible to take you all the way to the end. Yeah. Cool. So yep. you just, again, the mind wants to go into the future because, you know, we watch videos and, you know, in these videos, 10 years from now and 15 years from now, you know, it's the, uh, basically the end of human beings as physical and it's going to be uploaded in a computer system. Right? That's what you're relating to, right? AI. Yeah, and, well, that's, that's really, but right. I mean, just, uh, just the thing uh, with the new internet, which is going to work in completely different way than it's working now. So the, right. radi yeah. so the right. radiation waves is going to disrupt right. our... Right, exactly. Uh, yeah, everything's going to change and everything is changing. Yeah. But the source, the supreme being who is operating through all of us, if it wants life on this planet to continue, because it's itself, it will make adjustments to it somehow miraculously. It will create a situation that it works because it's its own expression. It's God expressing itself through all of us yeah. so if it wants this to continue it will create a new thing that you and i can't think about it because it's the infinite yeah so all of a sudden human body starts to produce a, a hormone or a protein that is resisting to radiation all of a sudden something appears you yeah. know yeah, it, it will adjust itself to whatever is happening. Okay, yeah, it makes sense, yeah. Right, so we just come back again to here. We practice what we have to practice is to simply be here and not go outside of here. Yeah. 